Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I want to go ahead and shout out Patricia Edwards. Patricia sent me this story and it's concerning Ice-T's grandson. His name is Elijah Morrow. And what's going on is that this young man is 19 years old and he has now been arrested for reckless handling of a firearm. Basically, he was playing with a gun and it went off and he killed his roommate, another 19 year old. His name was Drez Johnson. This whole situation is just really, really sad and disturbing. I'm going to go ahead and play you guys a news clip right now and then I will come back with the rest of my Following time. a developing story tonight out of Cobb County where police are investigating the deadly shooting of a young man. Authorities say Elijah Marrow was handling a gun and it went off and shot his roommate Darius Johnson on accident. Johnson was rushed to the hospital from the columns of Bentley apartment complex. Those are on Bentley Road in Marietta. And according to TMZ, Marrow is the grandson of rapper and reality star Ice-T. He faces several charges, including possession of marijuana. Right now, he's in the Cobb County Jail. You guys just watched the news clip, and a lot of folks were shocked that Ice-T had a grandson this old, because most folks only know about Ice-T's son, the one that he has with Darlene. And what's funny is that his son and his grandson are basically about the same age. Um, his son, ha his grandson has been featured on the show Ice Loves Coco. He's been on there before. Um, Ice-T's grandson is by his oldest daughter. Her name is Letitia, and she's in her mid to late 30s. He had her when he was a senior in high school. A lot of folks don't realize that he has an older daughter, but he does. And this is just sad. This was a young man who had only 19 years old, was out here playing with guns and everything else, and now he's accidentally shot his roommate. This is why a lot of folks need to start treating guns with respect. First of all, a gun is not a toy. I don't know how many stories we've done about just regular people, people who are not grandchildren of famous people, you know, out here playing around with guns, you know, spinning them around, you know, just doing all types of crazy stuff, and then the gun ends up going off and killing their best friend. A few months ago, we had the story about the little boys who were taking selfies, you know what I'm saying, they were 14 and 15 taking selfies with guns to their head, and then all of a sudden one of the guns went off while they were taking a selfie. You know, we need to realize that guns are not toys and we need to treat them with respect. You know what I'm saying? Like this whole situation could have been avoided. Now this young man is 19 years old. He's about to spend the next few years in prison. He, his best friend and roommate is now dead. Nobody wins in this situation. And another thing I kind of find crazy about this is that this is like the second grandchild to be affected by a legendary West Coast rapper. If you guys remember a year ago, I had did this story about um about DJ Quick's daughter who was basically arrested and charged with first degree murder for the death of his grandson. So to me, it's very ironic that two legendary West Coast rappers have two Two grandsons that have been affected in such a tremendous way. And my heart definitely goes out to Ice-T and his family and definitely the victim's family. This was just definitely some reckless stuff and, and people need to seriously take this as a lesson and stop treating guns like they're toys because like I said in a lot of these cases all of these things could have been prevented. So anyways go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire situation. How did you feel when you first heard this story? And what do you think about folks out here, you know, walking around with guns and just being really, really reckless with their guns as opposed to using common sense and realizing that guns are not toys? Let me know your thoughts on this entire situation. All right. Deuces.